Ireland Connected in association with Pigsback.com. You get more back with Pigsback.com. Now, from a website that could help you to stop smoking to one showing the evening courses available in your local college, our internet expert Maeve Nisi joins us now with the five top websites this morning. Thank you very much for joining us. Good morning. Everybody, or not everybody, there's a large section of the population that decides they'd like to do further education or they'd like to improve themselves in some way. Yeah. And the best way and the best option is, an, is a course at night. Yeah. So where do you start? Well, that's the thing. You're going online trying to find out. There's so many courses. <laughs> and if you start trying to look at each individual college, you're just going to get yeah, completely dizzy. overwhelmed. Because <laughs> the choice in, in courses is, is phenomenal. From um, you know, self-improvement to making yourself more employable or just a hobby. Yeah. Uh, and they tend to be, you know, every college is offering a different kind of mixture. Right. So some the sites that have come together now that give you a good directory of all the different courses that are available to you. So you can either choose you know, by college or you can choose by subject. Yeah. And uh, two particularly good ones I, I spotted were nightcourses.com because they've got a very good variety of courses uh, and a very good search engine so you get a good set of results based on what you're looking for. Um, so, you know, you, if you said, say, for example, you want to pick a part-time course, yeah. an evening course, a full-time course, uh, you know, all of those, you can select those options or you can pick by subject. And night um, courses will have, will night have courses, it Night courses, exactly. And is there anyone oversees the whole lot of this? Like, there's a, there's a pal of mine and he, he, he lectures in the evenings in Ross Mini College in Dublin. He does yes. Spanish and IT. Yeah. And the classes are small which is great, he says he can get around everyone and it's brilliant. Yeah. And are they all like that? Are they all carefully run? Or? That, that's a very interesting point because there's another site called findacourse.ie and again, the reason I was looking for a couple of different ones to see if there's a bit of variety in terms of the information they give you because you, you, on both sites you get yeah. very little in terms of what's actually in the content of the course. All you get really is the duration, uh, the, the hours and the cost. You know, I mean, okay. they're very good results, but that's what the sites are doing. And then it's up, up to you then to go to the sites of the individual Ask, college out. and find out more information. So it's not going to give you everything, but it gives you a good shortlist to work from. Excellent. And findacourse.ie then, it's, it's, it's kind of similar. It's very, very similar, but it's a little bit broader because it deals with not just night courses, obviously, but also ones that are in, in, straightforward college okay. courses, full-time courses, good variety. But both of them are very, very good, very in-depth. Uh, and they've got good search engines to make it easier for you to narrow down what you're looking for. Excellent. Yeah. All right. Now, a lot, a lot, at this time of year, a lot, a lot of parents tending to focus on the junior cert and leaving cert exams, and obviously a lot of students as yeah. well. And grinds come into the mix. And how do we just get that extra bit out of our little Johnny or our little Jenny to, yeah. to make sure they come through this all right? It's actually quite hard to find good grind mm. teachers. I mean, you know, obviously the first thing you want to do is look at word of mouth of the other people out there who might, you know, know a good grind that they've had a good experience yeah. with. Um, but, but in the absence of that, you want to see if you can look for people people online and uh, there's two, two sites that do it and they do it very differently. One is called allhonours.ie okay. and allhonours.ie is really kind of an online community for anybody doing exams. So in other words, it could be the parents, it could be the kids themselves and it's like a community you can sign up to. I think they're 15,000 members. Brilliant. And you go in there and you can you could submit questions, there's forums, you can go and find information and guidance. But in there, there's a grinds directory. Okay. So you can go and pick under different subjects and obviously the more popular are areas where people feel they're more struggle with, yeah. like applied maths, etc., chemistry, there's grinds there. But from my understanding of what's there, they're posted by whoever's offering the grind themselves. So you're going to, you know, there's no kind of All screening. Right. So it's up to you yourself. to find out, you know, how qualified the person is, maybe get some references. But at least it's, it's okay. free and, and, you know, that service. The other one, which is grindsathome.com, is focused on giving you very much a very full directory of people completely around grinds and they'll do them for you at home. The fee is... Uh, I think it's 37 euro for, for a basic grind and the okay. more advanced grinds it goes up to 49 euros per hour now per session okay and there is a fee you pay to them for finding the tutor if you decide to keep the tutor after a month you pay 60 euro finders fee all oh, right but again there, i think that there's looks like there's a screening going on there in terms of the qualification but even then you're going to you need to check you Which know and get some yeah, references yeah, and any teacher who refuses i mean obviously don't deal with them because i mean if they have all the certs and if they have the qualifications they'll be they'll be proud to show you that there, there shouldn't be any problem but if somebody is yeah. as difficult as putting it off that that should be a warning sign in itself to say hang on this uh, this isn't right yeah i had grind, got grinds myself you know uh, and they worked brilliantly yeah. But I think you need, the, the, the success of a grind is how good somebody is at teaching, not just that they're qualified. Exactly, so yeah. I think it's getting a phone number to call and find out, you know, somebody else's okay. experience with the same teacher. And if you're smart, and even though it's 37 euro per hour, if there's two or three kids on the road doing the junior cert, maybe you could do a deal and maybe... Absolutely, it, bandy it, together it with other come, parents. It might come down a little bit. Um, just switching the, the focus slightly, healthline.com, what does that do? Well, I was, I was looking around, uh, Healthline is a fantastic portal, American, you know, I've put kind of warning signals around that because okay. a lot of the names of the products and the pharmacy 
pharmaceuticals are different brand names in, in the States, but healthline.com is a very, very well-respected health portal. So you can go there for all kinds of information. But what I was trying to look for, where was the best information for somebody starting the new year thinking I'm giving up cigarettes? All right. Um, and I've, I've given up cigarettes and I know that there's different stages you go through. At the beginning you want information about how you know, to convince yourself how bad it is for you, maybe it's more about health. Yeah. Then you need encouragement, then you need tips because there's lots of things that you can do to avoid getting in the situation yeah. where you're just going mad and you have to have a cigarette. And this site is the best source, I think, of information. And is it free? Pulled in one place. Oh, it's all free. Excellent stuff. Um, and it's just really basic good guidelines okay. and tips and for all the stages you go through. There's video content, there's and you've content. gone through all this. You've and I, look, I don't think I'm unique, but all yeah, the stuff yeah. they were saying there in the stages were it's exactly the same. I have people who are thinking of giving up, they, they, they like to see people who have been through the, the mill, as they say. That they and, can uh, believe that they can be free from smoking. Which is, it's very hard to imagine when you're addicted, you yeah, know, that you yeah. can have a time when you never even think about them. It's the savings seem to be huge. They have a calculator in there that you, which I thought was quite smart to calculate how much you spend, and I did it wrong the first time, but okay. when I did, sat down and really thought about it, I reckon I was spending four grand minimum a wow. year on cigarettes. And of course, that's 8,000 of, of your income before yeah, tax. before tax. So it's an awful lot of money. So maybe you should, the, one of the tips is to actually save that money for something really special. Give yourself, yourself a target. Yeah. You change the yeah. car or a brilliant holiday or yeah, something. exactly. All right, babe, we'll leave it there. How to quit smoking, uh, check out healthline.com. should give you a lot of help and a lot of insights into the, the whole process of giving it up and quitting and moving on, as they say. Mate, pleasure as always. Thank you very much Thank for joining us this much. morning. Ireland Elected, in association with Pigsback.com. You get more back with Pigsback.com.